If you enjoy food that involves cheese that's melted and gooey, you are going to love this snack that can be turned into a breakfast or a lunch and it's so easy to make. So first of all, you'll need either a nonstick skillet or a cast iron skillet that's really well seasoned. And I've got mine on the stove already heating up over medium heat. Then you're going to need some tortillas because these can wind up being a taco or a quesadilla, depending on how you maneuver this cooking process. And then you'll just need your cheese, which is a must, but then after that, the sky is the limit as far as what you want your fillings to be. So today I'm keeping it simple. I'm using some chopped green onions and some chopped sweet bell peppers. So let's get started. I'll show you what the little trick is to this. I've had my pan over medium heat, just warming up so that it's hot before I add my cheese. And for a tortilla about this size, I'm using about one third cup of grated cheese. And I'm just gonna dump it right in to the middle of my pan. And then just spread it out a little bit so that you have a nice even layer of cheese. You can hear it sizzling a little bit. And I'm just going to wait for it to get melted and bubbly and a little bit brown around the edges. So now you can see that my cheese is melted, it's really bubbly, and it's starting to get a little brown around the edges. So at this point, I'm going to put my tortilla right on top of the cheese. And then I'm just going to kind of mash it down a little bit so that the cheese sticks to my tortilla. And then I'm just going to use my spatula and gently flip the whole thing over. And then I'm going to add my vegetables to the top of the cheese. And remember, you can use whatever you want as toppings for this. And you'll probably want to chop them pretty finely so that they stay on a little bit better. Once you've got your toppings on, you can go back to your, tortilla, your uh, spatula and gently fold your tortilla in half. So I'm just going to transfer this right to my cutting board and it'll be ready to eat. I'm going to just cut this one in half because this one's going to be a snack. Well, maybe I'll cut it into quarters. That'd be easy to pick up and dip into my salsa. The cheese is melty, the vegetables are crunchy, it's nice and warm, and it's ready to eat. Mmm. Ooh. Mmm. <laughs> it's so good. You need to try this. I'm Sue Doden, sharing good food for Good Life 365.